Marcelino? Where's Marcelino? Where's Teresa? She needs to get over here. Good evening and welcome to the campus of Donahue Academy as I welcome you into the Sun Conference men's basketball game of the week. It's the home team, Ave Maria Gyrenes, who are 3-3 three and 1-0 three and and oh in the Sun Conference, facing off with the Florida Memorial Lions, who are 1-1 one and 1-1 one and one and one in the Sun Conference as well. I'm Billy Derrick coming to you live here inside Donahue Academy in Ave Maria, Florida. As I lead you into tonight's tip-off between your Ave Maria Gyrenes and the visiting FMU Lions. Again, tonight's tip-off is set for 7.30 p.m. Eastern time as we broadcast live here on the Sun Digital Network. Last time out, the Gyrenes had a historic victory. They defeated Kaiser 80 to 71 in their Sun Conference opener. Meanwhile, for Florida Memorial, they uh, their first three games were postponed. They lost 69-56 at Warner and then they defeated St. Thomas at home 77 to 73. Meanwhile, the Lions are averaging 66 points per game on 41% shooting from the floor. Leading the Lions is Sam Mack, who scored 32 points on 11 of 19 shooting against St. Thomas. Meanwhile, for the Gyrenes, they come into this week's game of the week averaging 76 points per game on 44% shooting from the field and Eric Klikas is leading the way. He is the Sun Conference Player of the Week for last week. He leads the Gyrenes in scoring, averaging 20 points per game. That's second in the conference on 53% shooting. The Gyrenes enter this contest having won six straight of the Lions, so the Gyrenes in this series have definitely dominated. It's almost time to sit back and watch an entertaining Gyrenes squad face off with another Sun Conference opponent. It's the Gyrenes and the Lions getting set to do battle here inside Donahue Academy. Tip off between Ave Maria and Florida Memorial here on the Sun Digital Network is coming up. I'd like to welcome you back here inside Donahue Academy as we are getting set for the national anthem prayer and starting lineups. Let's send it over to the PA announcer. Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome to the Nogoa K Donahue Academy. For tonight's basketball contest between the visiting Florida Memorial University Lions and your Ave Maria. At this time, please rise to your feet and pray and remain standing in the praying of our national anthem. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Heavenly Father, we ask your blessing on all who are gathered here for today's game between Ave Maria and Florida Memorial University. Give strength and protection to players on both teams and inspire coaches in their role as leaders. Watch over all who are trying to steal and support both teams. And in a special way, we pray in thanksgiving for the effort, commitment, and sacrifice demonstrated by both teams. This is our prayer, and we present it to Christ our Lord. Amen. Please in the, to the 
So there you have it. The starting lineups for both teams. Here you go for the Florida Memorial Lions. Number four, Aubrey Washington. Number 12, Sam Mack Jr. Number 13, Sh Shake Kabay. Number 21, Mubashar Ali. And number 23, Tristan Stevens. Meanwhile, for Ave Maria, you got Matt Gillis, Chase Culpepper, Fernando Salsamendi, Lucas Uzdevinis, and Eric Klikas. Head coach is Jamin Copeland. He's assisted by Paul Matthews, Ryan Klebeck, and Nahum St. Fort. Meanwhile, head coach for the Lions, Ansar Alamine. Second season in the helm at the Lions. Jason Gilliam Alexander, Andre Thomas, Juan Urbina, Sherman Gant, Fernando Rojas, Josh Woodley, and Josh Mendoza assist him on the staff. We're just about ready for tip-off here inside Donahue Academy. Ave will win it for Salsamendi, and here's Chase Culpepper. A couple of claps, and we're ready to go here inside Donahue Academy. Salsamendi will get things going. Up top to Gillis, swings it around to Uzdevenis. Up top to Klikas, has a little bit of space. Back to Gillis up top, he thought about a three, he'll drive, floater in the lane is good, no call. Defender fell down, but Gillis will take that, and the Gyrenes have an early 2-0 lead. Point guard for Florida Memorial as Aubrey Washington has it up top to Mubashar Ali. Ali hands it off to Tristan Stevens. Stevens, left-handed jump shot, corner is good. Stevens with some energy, whistle on the game clock, it looks like. Referees communicating, they'll re-inbound here. Score is tied at two. A couple of quick points here for either team. You had Gillis with a floater. And then Tristan Stevens, the junior out of Long Island, New York, knocked down a jump shot. And here's Culpepper guarded tightly by Washington. Washington, the senior, senior on freshman, point guard matchup. That should be fun to watch tonight. Gillis 
Gives it to Culpepper right wing. Back up top to Klikas. Klikas, the Sun Division Player of the Week. Salsamendi driving in. Finds Gillis baseline. Has some space. Lays it up and in. Matt Gillis with a couple of early buckets. And the Gyrenes take a 4-2 lead. Washington guarded by Klikas now. Culpepper. On Sam Mack Jr., floater is good. Mack Jr. with a bucket, another senior. Lions have four seniors in the starting lineup. Mack Jr. out of Chicago, Illinois. Cole Pepper kicks it out to Klikas, thought about it. He pump fakes a couple of times, had a wide open shot. Doesn't take it, arguably one of the best shooters in the conference. Uzda Venice down low, working on Mack. Uzda Venice kicks it out to Salsamendi. Seven on the shot clock. Salsamendi between the legs, left side, drives in, right hand reverse, thought he got fouled. Looks like there was a little bit of contact, no whistle. Here's Shakay Kebe, drives in, no call. That'll be Jireen's possession, Lions possession rather after that. Washington to inbound, quick tempo start to this one. We're tied at four with 18 to play. Last time out, the Jireen's ended their 22 game losing streak to Kaiser. Here's K-Bay driving in, kicks it out. Washington, Stevens again, spin move, left hand, free throw, jump shot, no good. Oh, he gets the roll. <laughs> Stevens gets the bounce, and they take a 6-4 lead. Another whistle. That's the second whistle right after Avave inbound. Referee coming over to the table. There's a shot clock issue right now. Seventeen fifty-six to play. Jireen's trail six-four. We talked about their victory over Kaiser. Eighty to seventy-one was a final score. Final score. Eric Klikas went off for twenty-two points in the first half. He ended up having thirty-five. So the Jireen's are now battling with Florida Memorial. The Lions rolling into town. They're looking for their second win of the season. Culpepper guarded by Washington. Again, the senior on freshman and another shot clock malfunction. That's going to be a side inbounds. Again, in the women's broadcast, we were not able to get the audio working. We have it working now, but we're still having some issues with the shot clock. So we appear to be good on the shot clock. Jireen still trails 6-4. 20 seconds on the shot clock. Culpepper, again, hounded by Washington. That's going to be a blocking foul on Washington. Culpepper likes it. That's his first, team's first, first foul of the game. Lions still up 6-4. Culpepper again. Coming off a double screen. He has a little space. Floater in the lane, no good. Gillis fought for the rebound. Washington has it on the floor still, and Klikas comes up with it. Klikas kicks it to Culpepper in the corner. Driving back out to Klikas. Still in the corner. Gets it out to Culpepper up top, Salsamendi. Nice pass inside to Gillis, is a little late, so it's stolen away by Mack Jr. Sam Mack Jr., another senior on this team, gets it to Aubrey Washington. Washington now guarded by Klikas, down low, turnover on Washington, intended for Ali. It's also Mendy now driving in. Wide open in the corner is Culpepper for three, no good. It's also Mendy grabbing it, tried to at least. Ball all over the floor so far. Jiren still down 6-4. Here's Shakay Kebe. We'll get it back up top to Washington. Cleek is on him. Slow start to this one for either team. We're almost four minutes into this one. Mack Jr. pulls up. Short jump shot off the back of the rim. Tipped up by Ali, and he grabs the rebound. Into the corner to Stevens. Stevens, left hand, behind the back. Good defense from Salsamendi. Washington had a shot. 10 on the shot clock, down low to K-Bay. Here's Ali, Ali with the positioning and he'll lay it in. Nice shot by Ali, the seven foot senior, seven feet tall, 220 pounds, 
out of Finland. He transferred from Southern University. Talented transfer is Ali. Ali here again. Here's the seven footer on Gillis. Ali rises up, lays it up, no good. But he's fouled, is that on the floor? Ali, very athletic looking, seven footer, able to run the floor. That's Matt Gillis' first foul. So Ali will head to the line. Klikas, Culpepper, Salsamendi, Uzdevenis, and Gillis all in the game. Ali at the line for two shots. Misses the first badly. Vince Venchelin will come in for Abe, the six foot three junior out of Port St. Lucie, Florida. Had some good minutes against Kaiser. Salsa Mendy and Uzdevenis really stepped up as well. They both had double figure points. Salsa Mendy had a double double, 12 points, 14 rebounds. Ali misses both. Uzdevenis had 13 points as well. So scoring was spread around at Kaiser. Salsa Mendy up top, 8 4 lead for the Lions over the Jirene. So here's Uzdevenis. Venchelin open for a little bit, guarded by Ali. Tried to get it into Gillis. Gillis right wing, guarded by Ali. Boy, is Ali tough to drive in on. Gillis floats it, no good. Rebound by Ali. No, Gillis taps it out. Gillis on the floor, he grabs it. Klikas. Klikas loses it, but Venchelin grabs it. Ball is all over the place. Uzdevenis wide open, no good. Rebound by Washington. Washington wide open. Mack Jr. thought about it. He'll drive in. That is out of bounds. That will be Lions possession. A lot of height and length on this Lions team. They got a seven footer in Ali. Tristan Stevens, 6'4. Shakay Kebe, 6'9. That's athletic, lengthy players here on this Lions team. Back in the game is Tristan Stevens. And the Lions want a timeout, so we will take a break and come right back. Jireen's trail 8-4 to the Lions here on the Sun Digital Network. I'd like to welcome you back inside Donahue Academy. Jirene's trail 8-4 to the Florida Memorial Lions here with just over 15 to play in the first half. Again, Jirene's coming off a big win over Kaiser. Meanwhile, for Florida Memorial, they are 1-1. One and, one, and this is only their third game of the season. Their first few games were unfortunately postponed. Obviously a crazy season with all the COVID-19 protocols. That's why the Jirens are playing inside Donahue Academy. Floater in the lane is no good from Terrence Clayton. Now in the game for the Lions. And here's Venchelin quickly up court. Venchelin in the corner to Klikas. Klikas drives baseline. Not much room. He might try to post up here. Spins, gets position, lays it up and in. That's what Klikas can do. The versatility on display. Jirens down two. Again, Klikas coming off a 35-point performance. Dribble handoff, here's Mack Jr. Nice move on Klikas to the left. Great defense by Salsa Mendy, but they're gonna call a foul on the floor. So Salsa Mendy called on the foul. The red shirt senior out of Brazil. And we'll get another timeout. This looks like to be a media timeout. Jirene's trail 8-6 here on the Sun Digital Network.
We're back here inside Donahue Academy. Jireen's Trail 8-4. 14-25 to play here in the first half. At the line is number 12, Sam Mack Jr., a senior out of Chicago. He attended Morgan Park High School up in Illinois. He came down to South Florida to play his college ball. They'll have two shots here. First one is good. In the game for Ave now is number two, Jose Sanchez, as Matt Gillis will get a break. Gillis has played solid minutes all season for Ave. Definitely needs a break. So Mac Jr. knocks down both. The lead is back up to four for the Lions. Here's Klikas leading things. Also in the game for the Lions is number 30, Andrew Drugan. Klikas has it, coming off a screen for Salsa Mendy. Off the screen, no good. Tapped out by Venchelon. No one there for Ave. Swing over to Mac Jr. Jr. turns it over. Here's Klikas up court. Good pass to Salsa Mendy, right hand. Got it. Big time finish from Salsa Mendy off the assist from Klikas. And the Jireens are down two. Jireens team again. Trying to continue play with chemistry. Still trying to learn how to play with each other. Great move by Tristan Stevens and one. Big time move. He had a jab step that got Sanchez leaning. And Sanchez couldn't catch up. Stevens with another bucket. Foul on number two, Jose Sanchez. His first personal foul. First foul on Sanchez right as he enters the game. So the Jireen's back down four. Free throw is good, so Stevens gets the three-point play. The Jireens are down five. Ooze to Venice, wide open. He'll take that and knock it down. Can't leave him open, especially if it's that wide open. He'll knock it down. 13-11 with 13 and a half to play here in the first. As I talked about, Ooze to Venice had 13 points against Kaiser in that historic win. He hit a big three for the dagger that put Ave up seven. Here's a shot that... Does not drop, and Uzda Venice says, I'll take it. Venchelon up top, crosses half court. Uzda Venice to back open for three. Got it! Uzda Venice heating up, and the Ave Maria Gyrenes take the lead. Timeout, Florida Memorial. Uzda Venice can heat up very quickly, and the Gyrenes up one with 13 to play. We'll be right back here on the Sun Digital Network. We're back here inside Donahue Academy. Ave Maria has a one point lead over Florida Memorial, 14-13 with just over 13 to play here in the first half. Couple of big time threes from Ouz de Venice give the Jireens a quick lead and that's how talented Ave is. They can shoot the ball and when they get hot, the score can change in an instant. Spin move here by Mack over Ventulin. No good, rebound by Sanchez. Klikas had Washington right there. That was Clayton, rather. Eventually on right wing. Has some space. Foul on the floor. So that basket will not count. Again, a very vocal Jireen bench. This team's always fun to watch. Very different team than last season. Coach Copeland bringing in a new culture, the new era. Had an exciting beginning. And they've already had a, 
historic win on their schedule. A couple of new subs here for the Lions. Number 21, Ali, and number 13, Kebe. Wide open, Uzavinis again, quickly guarded. Here's Klikas coming off a screen from Salsamendi. No, he'll go away from it. Back to Salsamendi. Salsamendi drives in, spins, fadeaway jump shot, no good. Sanchez battling for it. Uzavinis on the floor. Great effort by Uzavinis. He gets it back. He'll th think about a three, drives in. Nice dish to Sanchez, who lays it in. Great offense, but that started with the effort by Uzavinis there. Driving in, Washington floater, no good. Sanchez with a foul, that'll be his second. So you could see Sanchez come out here. Yep, Gillis will head back in. So that's the second foul on Sanchez. Culpepper will also head in. Just over 12 minutes to play as Washington has a couple of free throws coming up. Misses the first, so Washington, the senior veteran player. Hometown is Jacksonville, Florida. Transferred over from Broward College. Again, he's played a lot of college basketball over his time. And we'll again, we'll continue to watch this point guard matchup. Washington and Culpepper. Second free throw is no good. So both missed by Washington. Here's Venchelon at point guard. So both point guards in for Ave, Venchelon and Culpepper. We'll see who runs the team here. Gillis in the corner. Back to Klikas, over to Culpepper. Back to Uzdevenis. Uzdevenis guarded tightly now. Gillis thought about a three. Instead, Ali, the seven footer, was there. Gillis down low on Ali. Kick it to Klikas, great pump fake. Jump shot in the lane, no good. Battle for Uzdevinis has it. Venchelon wide open, corner three is good. Big shot from Venchelon, and the Gyrene's lead is back up to six. Again, the Gyrene's with their shooting ability can really light up the scoreboard. Boy, is Ali versatile up top as a seven footer. Stevens left wing three, no good. And Venchelon can't grab it, and Washington says, I'll take it. Back to Ali, no, Culpepper takes it away. Culpepper quickly up court with speed. Kicks it out to a wide open Uzdevinis. Oh, way off. Florida Memorial quickly up court after the miss. Mack with a guarded three, no good. Ali tried to grab it with one arm, unable to. Culpepper wide open, up court on Mack, lays it up. No, they're gonna call a charge. Wow, close call there, Culpepper. Obviously, in disgust of the call. Again, they can go either way. Copeland wants a word with a ref. In the game for Florida Memorial is Murad Berrien, the freshman out of Tampa, so he will do the point guard duties. Interesting call. We'll see how the referees continue to call this one. Jairin still lead 19-13 with 10.45 to play. Berrien at point, guarded by Klikas, up top to Ali. Whistle on the floor, that's gonna be a foul on Florida Memorial, that'll be on Ali. A lot of subs here early for the Lions. Muhammad Gilchrist in the game, as well as number 14, Ebenezer. Abu, Abu Gaye, Ebenezer Abu Gaye in the game. So again, heavy subs here for the Lions in this Sun Conference matchup. Whistle, that'll be a foul on the floor on number zero for the Lions. Gilchrist fouled Culpepper. Again, that was away from the ball. We'll have a baseline inbound. Again, waiting on that media timeout at 10 minutes. Yeah, and there, there will be a media, nope. Whistle, referees communicating. There's gonna be a foul.
So after all the communication, we're ready to go. Culpepper will inbound. Jirene's up 19-13. Gillis wide open. He'll pull up. Miss it long. Uzavinis, nice rebound. Puts it up to Culpepper who lays it in. Great passing so far tonight for the Jirenes. And that has brought them up to a 21-13 lead with 10 to play here in the first half. Dribble handoff between the two guards back up top. Mac Jr.'s played heavy minutes. Still in the game for the Lions. Dribble handoff to number 13. Big miss from K-Bay. Gillis says, I'll take it. He gets it, gets it up top to Klikas. Klikas with the ball. Dribble handoff to Ventulon. Ventulon, nice pass to Gillis, who finger rolls it in. Again, great passing by Ave, and they've got a 10-point lead. Culpepper. Guarding Gilchrist, here's Ventulon on Mac Jr. Kebe up top to Abogaye. Abogaye sets a screen for Barian. Barian almost traveled. Abogaye puts it up. That was Kebe, rather. He'll lay it in. 23 15, nine and a half to play. Culpepper quickly left, lay it up and in. How about the English from Culpepper? 25 15. 9-10 to play here in the first half. This team is fun to watch. Dribble handoff up top. Mac Jr. coming off a screen. Left hand gets it up top to Abogaye. Abogaye to Kebe. Kebe, floater, good. Kebe with a couple of buckets here. With his length at 6-9 and his athleticism, boy, is he hard to guard. Uzdevinis thought about a quick three. Jirenes will set an offense up. Ventulon, right wing. Hands it off to Klikas, to Gillis. Gillis to Ventulon, no, he'll fake it. Spin move, gets positioning, left hand, no, but he traveled. Gillis made the shot, but he traveled on the play. A little bit of shuffle of the steps. So 25-17 with eight and a half to play. Barry and, nice move, but Culpepper stayed with, stays with him. Mack Jr. with it now. It's really been ISO ball here for the Lions. They've been able to find their guy and get the shot. Mac Jr. elevates, no good. Rebound by Uzdevinis. Culpepper with it, driving. Finds Gillis, great find, but it's blocked by the Lions. Berrien with it now. Left hand, kicks it to Mac Jr. Mac Jr. tried to find K-Bay, and he turns it over. Culpepper with it. Up top to Gillis, great catch by Gillis. He's gonna be fouled by number zero, Gilchrist. Salsa Mendy will come into the game for Uzdevinis while Ali will check in for Abogaye. Good minutes from Uzdevinis. Again, Uzdevinis has been clutch all year with the big time threes. And he's already hit a couple tonight. Again, this is the Sun Conference game of the week. The Gyrenes Gy and the Lions. Ventulon out to Klikas. Klikas between the legs with the left. Floater in the lane is good. Tough shot from Klikas, gets it to go. 27-17 with seven and a half to play. Barian, left wing. Dribble handoff to Mack Jr. He's played nearly the whole game, it seems like. Left wing shot from Gilchrist, no good. Culpepper with it, almost stepped out on the baseline. Culpepper crosses half court. Gillis with a screen, he'll go off of it. Kicks it to Klikas. Klikas on the baseline. Guarded by Kebe, the 6-9. Forward for the Lions. Culpepper drives in, kicks out to a wide open. Gillis, one more. Salsamini wasn't ready for it. Instead, he pulls up, no good. Gillis will grab it, but he'll be out on Gillis. If you're Salsa Mendy there, you gotta be ready for that extra pass to knock down the three. I'm sure Copeland motioning that to him. Aubrey Washington back in for the Lions. He will lead the point guard duties. The senior out of Jacksonville, Florida, guarded by Culpepper. Clayton hands it off to Mack Jr. Back up top to Clayton. Right wing, K-Bay for three, way long. Rebound by Klikas. Good, tough rebounding here so far. But the Jirenes up top to Salsa Mendy, who lays it up and in. 
Salsamendi tough shot. Jirene's up 29-17 with just under six and a half to play. They get it down low to Ali. Spin move on Uzda Venice. Nice. Oh, man. That'll be a foul on the Jirens. We'll see who it's on. That'll be on That'll be on Salsamendi. That's his second foul. Salsamendi, the top dog leader of this team, and he leads by example. He's been doing things like that, playing tough defense all year. Stevens will come in for K-Bay. At the line is Mubashar Ali. Again, seven feet tall, 220 pounds. Senior transfer from Southern University. Stevens will have to head back out. Ali's first is no good. Boy, the Lions have struggled from the line. That hasn't helped them in their comeback efforts. They're going to have to find a way to keep getting to the line and also knock down their free throws. Ali's second. Got it. 29-18, just over six to play. Culpepper tightly guarded by Washington. The freshman has really stepped into this point guard role nicely. Comes off a screen from Salsa Mendy. Right wing, spin move. Backdoor cut to Klikas. Klikas behind the back to Venchelon. Jirene's great passing, couldn't get a shot opportunity. Here's Salsa Mendy. Wide open, Culpepper, top of the key. No good. Rebound by Stevens. Well, that would have been a big time shot to extend this lead even further. Here's Stevens' left wing. They're giving Stevens the three pointer. Obviously learning from their scouting report. Down low to Ali. Ali, big mismatch, whoever's guarding him. He has not been able to finish. That'll be out of bounds on the line. So the Jirenes take possession. Ali is seven feet tall. The tallest Jirene player is Joe Barrett, 6'11", freshman. He's really realistically the only guy that could match up. But the Jirenes have done a great job. They put Sanchez at 6'7 in there. They've also worked Gillis in there. And Uzdevin has done a nice job at 6'4". He's played tough down low on Ali. Salsamendi drives in on Ali. Whistle foul going up. So that'll be a couple of shots here from Salsamendi. So that's Ali's second. Again, if the Jirens can get Ali in foul trouble, take him out of the game, that'll pre create more opportunities. The Brazilian Salsamendi at the line. First one is good. 30 to 18. And the game is Kebe, senior out of the Bronx. Transfer from Miami Dade College. Thirty-one eighteen lead for Ave, just over five to play. Venchelon guarding Clayton. They kick it out to a wide open Stevens who knocks down a big three. That'll cut it back to ten. So the Lions hanging around. They jumped out to an early lead, and then the Jirenes have really pounced on their opportunities. Salsamendi driving in, kicks it to Uzda Venice. That'll be a foul on the Lions. So Salsamendi back to the line. On the floor, Venchelon, Klikas, Salsamendi, Uzda Venice and Culpepper for the Lions, Stevens, Mack Jr., K-Bay, Washington, and Clayton. First one from Salsamendi is good. Salsamendi gets one for one, but he grabs the rebound. Back to Klikas. Klikas in the paint. Nice fake. Can't finish. Puts it up with the one hand, and Salsamendi finds a way to put it in. Jirenes are finding many different ways to score tonight, and they will take that. 34-21, four and a half to play. Again, we talk about Klikas' versatility. 
Being able to go up there at six feet tall and put it up. Here's another big three from Mac Jr. Back up to a 10-point lead. Here's Culpepper, crosses over quickly. Floating the lane is no good. Rebound by Stevens. Big rebound from Tristan Stevens. Culpepper was ready. Behind the back, Stevens. Another between the legs. Left-hand finish, no good. Thought he had a chance at the backboard finish. Unable to complete it. Up top to Klikas. Klikas to Uzdevenis. Back to Klikas, wide open. That is clockwork for Klikas. I don't think he's going to miss that one very often. Wide open, one of the best shooters in this conference. 37-24, Ave. Drives in Washington, wide open. Good find to Clayton, right wing. Misses that, and Salsamendi is there. A little handoff from Uzdevenis to Salsamendi. Couple of crossovers, Salsamendi can't finish. Stevens up top, here's Clayton. Clayton, right hand, nice Euro step. Oh, and he can't finish. Uzdevenis, up court to Salsamendi. Back to Culpepper. Copeland wants a timeout and he will get it. 37-24, Ave leads with three and a half to play. Here at Di inside Donahue Academy, we'll welcome you back moments away here on the Sun Digital Network. Welcome back to the Sun Digital Network. Ave leads Florida Memorial 37-24 with 3.19 to play. Leading scorer in this one is Tristan Stevens with 10 points. Leading all scorers, Salsamendi strong with the right hand. Pushing in on K-Bay, picks it up, kicks it to Uzdevenis. 10 on the shot clock. Ventulon, left hand dribble. Finds Culpepper, got positioning on Washington and lays it in. Culpepper with a nice effort here to begin this one. Here's Clayton up top, guarded by Klikas. Big lead here, 39-24 for Ave. Washington quickly in the paint. Right hand floater, no good, but a whistle and a foul on the floor. Looks like it could be on Salsamendi. That'll be on Culpepper. Late call, Culpepper on Washington. That'll be his second. So Aubrey Washington at the line for one and one. Washington hits the first. In the game is Gillis. Gillis coming in for Salsa Mendy. Who's to Venice? Gillis, Klikas. Culpepper and Ventulon in the game for Ave. Washington knocks down both. It's 39-26, 13-point lead for Ave. Ventulon now at point. Ave really mixing it up there at the point guard spot tonight. Gillis over to Klikas, who has eight points so far. Ventulon almost a steal from Tristan Stevens. Gillis up top to Ventulon. Nice move, head fake, but it's stolen away by Washington. Klikas on defense. Good pass into Clayton, and he finishes. 39-28. We've got 2.15 to play here in the first half. Culpepper off a screen from Gillis. Back over to Gillis. Now Gillis off a screen from Culpepper. Foul on the floor, looks like on K-Bay. 
So that is Kebe's first foul. And Gillis will head to the line. Gillis, a sophomore transfer out of Cedarville, Division II school. Knocks down the first. Gillis has been a great acquisition for this Ave team. Great shooter, really good rebounder. And he seems to make the right play at the right time. So Gillis knocks down both. The steady forward, really been a reliable force for Ave this year. 41-28 with two to play. In between legs, KB got nutmegged. Here's Gillis with speed. Lays it up, no good. Culpepper battled for it, can't finish. Up top to Drugan, and that's going to be out of bounds. So unable to catch up to that one is Drugan, the junior, out of Hollywood, Florida. Just under two to play. Culpepper will lead the break. Ave, 41 points here in the first half. Culpepper up top. Crosses over with space. Culpepper, good look to Gillis. Lost it, and he loses it on the way up. Gillis had a wide open shot. Kebe driving in on Uzdevenis. Kebe loses it on the floor. Uzdevenis, whose is it? Is it out of bounds? That'll be Lions' possession. So again, our vantage point here on the right side. Tough to read really anything. Again, tight quarters here inside Donahue Academy. Yep, that'll be blue ball. A lot of perspiration there in the corner. Forty-one twenty-eight with a minute and a half to play. Great effort here by the sweat mop person. Got to give her credit. Copeland doing his own. FMU will inbound on the baseline inside to K-Bay. He's got good positioning. Kicks it out up top. Back to the corner. Washington three. Got it. Again, back down to a 10-point lead. Big shot for the Lions. Venchelon with it. Venchelon. Gillis, great find. How about the passing tonight? Venchelon with a couple of good passes, which have led to Ave points, and it's back up to 12. Washington double team. Culpepper with a little bit of pressure. Washington with it. Looks like an extended 2-3 zone now. Swings it over to Clayton. Clayton to Stevens. Thought about a three. Drive in. Kicks it out to an open Clayton left wing three. No good. Sky in for the rebound is K-Bay. K-Bay with physicality. He'll slam it in. How about that from K-Bay? And the Jirenes lead by 10. 40 seconds to play. Boy, you'd think with K-Bay, the play there... We'd see a lot more of that, but the Jirenes have found a way to contain him. Culpepper drives in, pull up, jump shot, no good. Rebound by Stevens. So a big opportunity here for the Lions if they take the last shot. Stevens, wild here, gets it to K-Bay. Drugan traveled. Tough turnover for the Lions. They had a chance to grab some momentum before first half, but they end up turning the ball over. And if your coach... Alameen, obviously tough there. Speaking of Coach Alameen, his coaching career with the Oakland Soldier in AAU powerhouse. He's produced NBA players such as Chauncey Billups, Chuck Hayes, oh, and also LeBron James. So obviously Alameen has been highly successful at the AAU and NBA levels. Cleekus right wing, no good. Rebound by the Lions. Washington, they have time. Washington crosses half court. Floater three is no good. And that will send us into halftime. Ten-point lead for Ave. Jireen's 43, Lions 33. We will take a break, come right back with a halftime report here on the Sun Digital Network.
unplugged. If this came unplugged, that means this call came unplugged. Welcome back inside Donahue Academy for tonight's Sun Conference Men's Basketball Game of the Week. It's the Ave Maria Gyrenes and the visiting Florida Memorial Lions. We tipped off at around 7.30. It's now approaching 9 p.m. here inside Donahue Academy as we get set for this second half. First half stats. Leading scorer for Florida Memorial was number 23, Tristan Stevens. Behind him was Aubrey Washington. Stevens had 10. Washington finished the first half. Oh, meanwhile, Sam Mack finished the first half with seven. And we're waiting on the officials. There they are. So the officials with a warm welcoming, I guess they thought it was 15 minutes of halftime. So interesting start to this second half. Everybody fired up. The officials are back. Meanwhile, for the Ave Marie Gyrenes in the first half, they were 17 of 37 from the field. That's 46%. Three-point line, they were 4 of 11, 36%. On the scoreboard, 10 points for Gillis, 8 for Salsamendi, 8 for Klikas, and 6 for Uzdevinis, also 6 for Culpepper. So scoring is spread around here for the Gyrenes. 10-point lead, Culpepper on Mac Jr. Nice finish from Mac Jr to start the scoring, and they've already cut the lead to eight. Culpepper up top. Culpepper, left-hand dribble. He'll try to look for Klikas on the back cut. Nice defense by K-Bay. How about this matchup? Six-foot Klikas on, seven, on six foot nine, K-Bay. Culpepper has to pick it up. 10 on the shot clock. Klikas driving in, kicks it to Salsa Mendy. Drives in on the baseline. Oh, that's gonna be stolen away. Tough pass from Salsa Mendy. Here's Washington, rises up, and he'll lay it in. 43-37, it's down to six. How about the start? 4-0 run here in the second half for the Lions. With that lay-in from Aubrey Washington, he now has seven points. Here's Mac Jr., and one. How about the start for the Lions? 43-39, an early 6-0 run. Jai Reed's got to get some more energy in him, or else this is going to be a tight one here throughout the second half. So Sam Mack Jr. with the and one. He's got 12 now. He's got as many points as his number. Six foot four senior out of Chicago with a big start to this second half. Misses the three point play, so the Jai Reed's still up by four. Whistle. The referee not happy with Sam Mack Jr. not tucking his jersey in. It's not hard to tuck your jersey in. So Corin Bradley Jr. will head in, the freshman. Four point lead for Ave. Those are the type of things if you're the Lions, you just can't allow happen. Culpepper, close one there on the backcourt. Pepper right hand dribble. Thought about a pass to Salsa Mendy instead. Nice shot in the lane. Got it. Big finish from Culpepper to put the Ave Maria Gyrenes up six. Now it's time to put the clamps on. Culpepper guarding Washington tightly. Try to get it into Ali. No. That's all on the defense for Culpepper. Hounding Washington. And so far, the freshman Culpepper has outplayed Washington. Looking at Culpepper's stats, he's now got eight. Same with Washington, but defensively, Culpepper's played tremendous. Salsa Mendy, little shift, finds Gillis. Gillis rises up, right hand, got it! And one, Maddie Gillis. Boy, Gillis is playing really well tonight for Ave. He's now got 12. Big time finish over the seven-footer, Ali. 
could argue Gillis has been the lone Jirene's post presence just battling week in and week out. Three-point play, got it. Gillis, 13 points with 18 to play here in the second half. 48-39, Washington crosses half court. Guarded by Klikas. Washington, left wing, gets it to Mack Jr. on Culpepper. Mack Jr. working, tapped out by Culpepper. Uzevinas has it, he's got Klikas, tapped away by Washington. That'll be out on Klikas. Klikas, last one to touch it. Tough look, gotta convert there if you're Ave. In the game again is Corin Bradley Jr. Bradley Jr., the freshman out of Gainesville, Florida. Getting his second look tonight. 48-39 with just under 18 to play. Here's Washington motioning to his team. Guarded by Klikas, up top to Kebe. Kebe guarded by Gillis. Here's Mac Jr. coming off a screen. Mac Jr. with a right hand, no good. Rebound, Salsamendi. Oh, it gets tapped out. Mac Jr. right hand, he will finish that. Jirene's got a rebound, they're up seven. 17 and a half to play. Corner, Uzavinis. Thought about a back cut, he'll get it up to Salsamendi. Salsamendi crosses over, spin move in the lane, picks it up, kicks it out to Klikas. Corner three, no good. Rebounded by Tristan Stevens, and that's gonna be out of bounds. The Lions stepped on their baseline, and that'll be Jirene basketball. Coach Alameen not happy with that. Alameen, again, a great leader, one of the better coaches here in this Sun Conference. According to Sean Marion, direct quote, Ansar is one of the top three workout trainers in the country. Bang, from Klikas. Again, you cannot lose Klikas, or else that will happen. 10-point lead for Ave, 17 to play. Mac Jr. up top to Kebe. Kebe driving in on Gillis. He'll lay it in. Whistle on the floor. Washington looks a little banged up. There'll be a timeout on the floor. Injury timeout. We'll take a break. Jirene's up by seven. 51-43, just under 17 to play. So no timeout registered, it was a simple injury, take a break. Each team did have, a, have some time to take a breather, settle down, and hopefully if you're watching, you get to settle in and watch a fun second half finish between the Jirenes and the Lions. 51-43 lead for Ave. Klikas finds Salsa Mendy with space, drives in on Ali, no good. Rebound, that was Kebe rather, Kebe saves it and finds Clayton to Mac Jr. Pull up, no good. Rebound by Salsamendi. He's been big time on the boards tonight. Culpepper crosses over with space, dishes it to Gillis. That'll be a defensive foul on K-Bay. K-Bay's been active tonight. Hasn't really got much to go his way, but he's definitely been a force for the Lions. That is K-Bay's second foul. Again, more perspiration. We'll take a break here. Klikas, Salsamendi, Uzdevenis, Gillis, and Culpepper in the game. Culpepper to inbound. Again, Culpepper. Really a reliable force at point guard so far this year as a freshman. Salsamendi, possibly a push off, no call. Klikas pulls up, left wing. No good, short, Gillis fights for it. That could have been an over a back. Again, refs letting the boys play tonight. Salsamendi steals it, throws it to Culpepper. Culpepper with space. Right hand hesitation, right hand, no good. That'll be a defensive foul, and Culpepper will go to the line. Exciting back and forth game right now. Jirene still up 51-43. Whistle, and now we will get a full timeout called by Coach Alamine. Jirene's up 51-43, 16-10 to play. You're listening to men's basketball here on the Sun Digital Network.
And we're back here inside Donahue Academy. Ave Maria leads the visiting Florida Memorial Lions 51-43. Just over 16 minutes to play here in tonight's Sun Conference men's basketball game of the week. Ave 3-3 three and three on the season. Here's Culpepper at the line. Knocks it down. Culpepper, the big night, especially here in the second half. Really being a defensive force. Again, Jirenes, we talked about it a lot, coming off a historic win over Kaiser. First win over the Seahawks in program history. Can they keep that momentum of the Sun Conference going tonight? 10-point lead, Culpepper with a tip, and that'll be out of bounds. Culpepper with the great defense. And that's what he's here for. Such a presence defensively. Terrence Clayton struggled with it, the junior. Cleek is to inbound, and that very close to a five-second call. Culpepper in the backcourt. Got to get it across. Turns around Clayton. Right wing to Uzdevenis. Uzdevenis, again, close travel. Gillis up top. Dribble handoff to Culpepper. Wide open. Floats. Misses. That'll be rebounded by Mack. Mack Jr. up top to Stevens. Left hand. Strong, but can't finish. Gillis with a rebound. Can Ave extend their lead? Klikas with a ball. Klikas hesitation. Nice pass to Culpepper on the reverse. Klikas to Culpepper. And the Gyrenes have a 12 point lead. Beautiful find by the savvy Klikas. He's just a gamer. Very fun to watch. Mac Jr. right wing three, no good. Battled for Culpepper there, but how about the rebound from Bradley Jr.? Preserves a possession for the Lions. Clayton with the ball inside to Stevens. Nice turnaround move. No call, and that'll be a bucket for Stevens. Ten-point lead for Ave, under 15 to play. Salsa Mendy with it on the left wing. Over to Uzdevinis. Cleek is right wing. Hesitates a couple times. Spin move. Eases his way into the lane. Klikas fakes behind the back pass to Gillis. Oh, boy. Klikas is showing off at this point. 12-point lead again for Ave. How about the trickery from Klikas tonight? Deep three from Mac Jr. off the front. That'll be a dead ball. And a couple of subs are in for Ave. Sanchez and Venchelon will come in for Uz Divinis and Gillis. Boy, Klikas may not have lit up the scoreboard in the first half and even here in the second, but the passes he's shown tonight has really helped the Gyrenes extend their lead. Now up 12 on the Lions. Venchelon crosses over off a double screen. He's got Uz Divinis. Tough shot up top, a little air ball. Who's to Venice? He can hit those guarded shots. 12 point lead for Abe, under 14 to play. Culpepper on Clayton. Clayton, jump stop, gets it to Stevens. Stevens, a little 2 3 zone, it looks like here for Abe. Driving in is Bolden Jr. Tough finish, got it. And one for the freshman, Bradley Jr., rather, out of Gainesville. He comes in, cuts the lead to 10. So Bradley Jr. knocks down, finishes the three-point play, and the lead is back down to nine. So Ave really hasn't been able to break open this game. The Lions are hanging in. Klikas up top, right wing Culpepper. Left hand, strong, picks it up, gets it to Sanchez, top of the key three, no good. That'll be out of bounds. Sanchez upset after that, but again, Jirenes have shot the ball well tonight, why not? 13 and a half to play. Looks like a 1-3-1 now with Culpepper up top. Clayton, no foul, Culpepper on his feet. Almost got another steal. Clayton, wide open, Mac Jr. right wing, too long. Uza Venice will take it. Venchelon in the middle. Venchelon, he's got Uza Venice. Uza Venice, wide open, right wing. Bow in and out, no good. Here's Stevens. 
Again, Stevens has been contained. The players to watch for the Lions have been contained tonight by the Jirene defense. In a zone now, it looks like. Clayton, top of the key three, got it. Big three from Clayton. 57-51, Lions creeping back in. Bradley Jr. having some good minutes. Culpepper drives in, whistle, foul on the floor, it looks like. It'll be on Clayton. Salsamendi and Gillis will enter for Culpepper and Uzdevinis. Benchelon, Gillis, Klikas, Salsamendi, and Sanchez in the game. Here's Sanchez with it. Picks it up in the corner to Klikas, whistle, illegal screen on Gillis. So in the first half, Jireen's shot 36% from three. And they have no doubt improved that mark, shooting well here in the second half. They've only got a six-point lead. Clayton drives in on Klikas, lobs it to Ali with positioning. Right-hand finish is good. So Ali finding a way to put it in. 57-53, Salsa Mendy, that'll be a block. Salsa Mendy had a little bit of momentum, I mean, he had a step on his defender. So he'll drive in, that'll be on the floor, so baseline inbounds. Uzdevinis right back in the game for Sanchez. Ventulon to inbound. Again, perspiration wiped up. We've seen a lot of that tonight. Ventulon on the baseline, finds Gillis quickly. Nice, crafty finish. Gillis has really found a way to, I, I want to say dominate the Ali matchup. Ali's got three, four inches on him, and Gillis has outplayed him. Off the rim, and Gillis takes it. Klikas crosses half court. Klikas, oh, what a pass again from Klikas. I mean, it's another reason why Klikas is leading the team in minutes, and he also won Sun Conference Player of the Week last week. 61-53, it's back up to eight. Clayton with the ball. He's played a lot of minutes here in the second half. Bradley Jr. with it. Bradley Jr. pulls up. Open shot, no good. Salsa Mendy grabs it. Here's Ventulon. See if Ave can break it out here. Ventulon to Salsa Mendy. Nice pump fake. Drives in with the left hand. Crafty, no good. Off the front of the rim. And Ali with a rebound. Nice find in the corner. Bradley Jr. Kicks it out wide open, Clayton three, no good. Ali tips it in though. Ali very active on the boards tonight. And that gives a six point deficit with 10.45 to play. Klikas open left wing, got it! Eric Klikas shooting the ball well tonight, passing the ball well tonight. And usually when both those are happening, the Jirenes are winning and they've got a 10 point lead again. Klikas has made winning plays. There's another tap away from Klikas. Two Jirenes fall on the ground. Copeland called timeout. Luckily for them, they didn't give it to him. Uzdevenis crosses midcourt. Salsa Mendy open, rises up, wanted to dunk it. No call. going to be out of bounds in Lions possession, according to the ref. A lot of perspiration here on the left side of your screen. So tough call there. Interesting. Salsa Mendy rose up, thought he got it tipped away and off of the Lions, but the Jirenes lose possession. They're still up by 10, just over 10 minutes to play. Here in the game of the week on the Sun Digital Network. Last week, Cleek is with 35. This time out looking at Cleek is, he's already got 14, but also six assists. And Half of those assists have been a lot of trickery involved. Here's Clayton right wing, gets it to Stevens. Stevens down low to Ali, he's got positioning on Gillis, loses it, Let right hand finish is good. Boy, Ali could do that, seems like every time. Lions haven't been able to get the ball down into him. 
64-57. Ventulon behind the back, up top to Gillis. Saw Semendi left wing. Who's to Venice thought about it, down low to Gillis. No foul on Mack Jr. Gillis, no call there again, and Gillis will lay it in. Boy, they're letting them play tonight. And they will call it, a very late call. That call on Mack Jr. Timeout on the floor, media timeout. Jirene's lead 66-57, nine and a half to play here on the Sun Digital Network. Welcome back inside Donahue Academy. Jireen's lead the Lions 66-57 with nine and a half to play. Can the Jireen's hold on? They were in somewhat of a similar position against the Seahawks. They had to fend off a Seahawk comeback, and they did. They ended up winning 80-71 to and beating the Seahawks for the first time in school history. Meanwhile, tonight, similar situation. Got nine and a half to play. Can the Jireen's... Hold their lead. They got a nine-point lead. Cleek is guarding on the left wing. 2-3 zone here for Ave. Tristan Stevens, big step back off the front of the rim. No good. Gillis, big time rebound on Ali. Cleek is crosses half court. Over to Salsamendi. Spin move. Right side, baseline. Step back. No good. Gillis taps it. That'll be out of bounds. And Jirene possession. Gillis really playing well tonight. Scrappy on the boards. Finding a way to get rebounds on Ali at seven feet tall. Ventulon to inbound. Ventulon lobs to Uzda Venice, kicks it, great pass. Salsa Mendy with it now, bang! How about that from Fernando with a smile? Knocks down the three, 12 point lead, Ave. Down low to Ali, wide open, blocked by Salsa Mendy, they call a foul. Oh, wow. Very close call there. Jirene's will take the foul. Two shots coming up for Mubashar Ali. That'll be Salsa Mendy's third. Salsa Mendy banged up here in the corner, and the Florida Memorial trainer. So Salsa Mendy call with a foul. Culpepper will come in. Again, 12-point lead for Ave. Ali has got a chance to cut it to 10 with a couple of made free throws. First one is good from Ali. Ali, the Finland native. Again, started at a big time D1 program, Southern. Now he's playing in Miami for Florida Memorial. Knocks down both high arcing free throws. And it's back down to 10 with just under nine to play Ventulon at point. Ventulon guarded by Stevens. Up top to, Sal to Uza Venice, rather. Right wing Culpepper. Bounces it to Klikas. Klikas. 
faked a jump shot. Great pass again. Gillis open. Somebody's got to shoot it. Gillis shuffled his feet. Again, the pass from Klikas is what impresses me most. Culpepper kicked it out to, Cle to Gillis. Culpepper up top, a little bit of 1-3-1 one, again. Although they'll, they'll go man-to-man. -man. Clayton handoff to Stevens. Here's Ali. Back to Drugan, who's back in the game. Drugan drives in, kicks it wide open. Good find to Clayton. Got it. Big time shot lead back to seven. 69-62, just over eight to play. Klikas right wing. Crosses over. Good defense here from Clayton. Klikas will ease his way into the lane like he loves to do. Klikas fakes, gets it to Uzdevenis. Guarded three, got it! That does not matter. Uzdevenis with a hand in the face, knocks it down, and the Jirene's back up by 10. 7.40 to play, Ali with it. Wanted to get it to Mac Jr., but Klikas is there. Here's Drugan. Drugan left hand pull up, no good. And Gillis is there for the rebound. Jirene's really playing well on the boards as well. It's been a big factor tonight. Culpepper left wing. Swings it to Klikas. Klikas says, I'll take this and I will miss. Sky for the rebound is Clayton. Clayton to Drugan. Drugan might have shuffled. Down low to Alab to Ali, and he will miss. Nice defense by Ventulon, but that'll be a foul anyway. Gill is unable to get in front of Ali. And typically, if you can't front Ali, he will get the bucket or the foul. So K-Bay and Salsamendi back in for Drugan and Ventulon. So you got Salsamendi, Gillis, Uzdevinis, Culpepper, and Klikas in the game for Ave. That foul was definitely on the floor. Referees in communication. Stevens is already ready to inbound. So that foul again on 20. Who's to Venice? Guarding K Bay. Stevens gets it in. Clayton thought about it. Clayton skips it all the way across to Mac Jr. for three. Short. Nice rebound by Salsamendi, and he's tapped on the head. Big time positioning by Salsamendi to grab it over Stevens. That'll be Stevens' first foul. 72 62. It's back up to 10 for Ave, just under seven to play. Salsamendi will hand to Culpepper. Final seven minutes of this one here in the Sun Conference men's basketball game of the week. Up top to Gillis. Gillis, triple handoff to Culpepper. Culpepper to Klikas. Klikas, nice move. Drives in, floater over Ali, no good. Ali will grab that. Here's Stevens up court. Can the Lions get back in this one? They're down 10. Ali, right wing, three, no good. Rebound off the top, Uzdevenis has it, but that'll be a dead ball. Again, I think the key to this one for Ave is defending Ali in the final six and a half minutes. They've done a great job so far. In the first half, they held Ali to three points. And he's only had a couple of buckets here in the second half, so they've done a tremendous job on the seven-footer. Klikas. Down low to Salsamendi. Spins, right hand, jump shot, got it. What a finish from Salsamendi. Stevens left hand on Salsamendi, high off the glass, got it. It's back to 10. Just under six to play, Stevens knocks it down. Lions gotta get a stop here or else time will run out on them. Salsamendi up top. Meanwhile, for the Jirenes, do they stay conservative? Or do they get more aggressive here to close out? Who's to Venice with a spin move? Who's to Venice? Picks it up to Salsamendi. Eight on the shot clock. Salsamendi with it. Looks like he'll go ISO. Ball screen from Gillis. Salsamendi pulls up. No good. 
Cole Pepper, tough rebound, and he gets it out of bounds, but what did it hit his shoe? No, it didn't. Great effort by Cole Pepper. The effort, commitment, sacrifice, toughness. Too many, too many adjectives out there to describe the Jireen's effort tonight. This will be a tough victory, and the Lions will get a timeout here. Jireen's up 10, 74-64, with just under five and a half to play here on the Sun Digital Network. Welcome back inside Donahue Academy. Ave Maria up 10 on the Florida Memorial Lions here in tonight's Sun Conference men's basketball game of the week. Baseline inbound for Culpepper. Lobs it to Salzmeni, a little too high. Stevens with some speed on Uz Devinis. Eurostep lays it in, and it's back down to eight. There's Tristan Stevens. He's got 16 tonight, leads the Lions. Klikas with the ball over to Salzmeni. A little bit of 1-3-1, it looks like. Potentially an extended 2-3 zone. Klikas wants it, he will get it. Klikas to Culpepper. Culpepper, spin move, right hand, pass to Gillis. Good! How about Matt Gillis tonight? He's got 21. He's also got seven rebounds. Big time effort from the transfer. Ali, guarded by Gillis, here's Kebe who has been quiet tonight. Ali, nice pass to Stevens. Stevens, left-hand dribble. Lobs it into Ali. Uza Venice there with a deflection. Salsamendi with it, and he'll be smart and take it back out. Nice decision from Salsamendi. Here's Culpepper, though. Aggressive corner three, no good. Salsamendi tips it back up and in. Salsamendi, he's got 17. The Jireens have one, two, three, four players in double figures. Culpepper on defense. So nice spread out scoring tonight for Ave. A lot of scoring too, with four minutes to play, they got 78 on the scoreboard. 10 on the shot clock, Stevens, left hand jump shot, got it. He's been keeping the Lions within striking distance. 3.45 to play. 10 point lead for Ave, here's Culpepper. Culpepper to Salsa Mendy. Got some space, rises up, and it's blocked by Ali. Little meeting at the rim between Ali and Salsa Mendy. Stevens with it now. That's what you think you would see a lot more from Ali, but he hasn't been as active. I think you give the Jireens a lot of credit in limiting him tonight. Stevens to Ali. Ali to Mac Jr., open. Guarded by Culpepper, tough shot, no good. Good job by Culpepper there, getting a hand in the face of Mac Jr. Mac Jr. had a big first half at 12 points. He's only scored one in the second half. So the adjustments made at halftime proved to be crucial here in the second half. Klikas to Gillis again. Gillis, nice spin move, but blocked by Ali. Ali just a little too tall. Up court, here's K-Bay. K-Bay right hand, got it. It's back up to eight. 2.45 to play. Can the Jirenes hold on? They win tonight, they'll improve to four and three overall, two and zero oh in the Sun Conference. Timeout, Jamin Copeland. We'll get the final two and a half minutes of this one tonight, Ave and Florida Memorial. 
coming right up here on the Sun Digital Network. Welcome back inside Donahue Academy. Ave leads Florida Memorial 78-70. Two and a half to play. Should be an interesting final two and a half minutes inside Donahue Academy. Again, this is a Jireen seventh game of the year. Meanwhile, for the Lions, they've only played two games. So that could be a part of tonight's matchup. But both teams are dealing with the same circumstances. And they're rolling with the punches. Here's Gillis open. Didn't take it. Saw some Endy right wing. We got 10 on the shot clock. Salsa Mendy crosses over. Spin move on Stevens. That's his move, and that's his bucket. Salsa Mendy now with 19. Second on with a Jireens. Gillis has 21. Salsa Mendy with 19. Bradley Jr., tough finish. He'll make it back up to an eight point lead. Just over two to play. Lions really going to have to start getting some stops now, or else. The time will not become their friend. It's already not one of their friends. Klikas, right wing. That's who you want the ball in the hands of. Klikas, being hounded by Bradley Jr. Drives in, left hand finish, no good. Looks like it might have been blocked by Ali. Whistle, Culpepper will go into the game. Culpepper will head in for Ventulon. 80-72 lead, 140 to play. Can the Jireens hold on? At point, it'll be Clayton. Clayton tonight has eight points, four assists. He's turned into the point guard after Washington was injured early in the second half. Ali between the legs, loses it. Here's Salsa Mendy with space. Salsa Mendy three on one to Gillis. Back to Salsa Mendy, rises up. No, missed it. Gillis on the floor, battle for it's a scrum right now. Whistle, that'll be a foul called on the Lions. He could have had a few different calls there, but Gillis will head the line, it looks like, after the foul on number 13, K-Bay. So Gillis at the line, he's got 21 tonight. Gillis also with eight rebounds. So we could be seeing our MVP close out this one tonight. Waiting on the perspiration. Again, you got 119 to play. Gillis at the line for two. One and one, rather. Gillis knocks down the first. Gillis. Originally from Castleberry, Florida. He started at the Masters Academy. And then he went up to Ohio to play at Division II Cedarville. So now he's back home playing for Ave. Very close to his hometown, Castleberry. And he knocks down both. He's got 23 tonight. Clayton, pull up, jump shot, no good. Gillis almost there. Stevens grabbed it, though. Stevens has been big tonight. Not quite enough, though. Ave still up 10. Rising up is number five, Corin Bradley Jr. with a bucket. And it's back down to an eight point lead. Ave 82, Florida Memorial 74 with a minute to play. We'll get the final minute here on the Sun Digital Network coming right up.
Welcome back to Ave Maria, Florida, here in sunny southwest Florida. Ave leads 82-74, over a minute to play. Still a lot of time for Florida Memorial to claw back, but Jairines are going to have to make a lot of mistakes, and they're going to have to knock down some big shots. Saul Semeni on the baseline. He can move, and he'll take a timeout. We will take one as well. Sun Digital Network coming up. And we're back once again here inside Donahue Academy. The Jirenes are still up on the Lions, 82-74. Just over a minute to play. Full court press for the Lions. They got a lot of length in there. Kebe at 6'9", Ali at 7 feet. Here's Klikas, bounces it to Salsamendi. Over to Ventulon. Ventulon back to Salsamendi. They got to get it across here. Getting closer to 10, Salsamendi finds a way to get it across. Over to Uzavinis, turns it over, but Uzavinis finds a way to grab it. Uzavinis finally gets fouled. Stevens had a couple of taps in there. So Uzavinis will head to the line. So Uzavinis at the line. Uzavinis tonight, nine points. Misses that one. So big miss there, 42 seconds. Stevens drives in on Ventulon. Blocked by Ventulon, big block. Stevens gets it right back and misses. Ball loose. Gillis has it and he's fouled by Stevens. So tough couple of misses there from Tristan Stevens. He's been the leader tonight for the Lions, but he's, been, he's had a couple of tough misses that has not gone his way. That's his third foul. Out of frustration, Jiren's going to have to make free throws here to put it away. Gillis at the line. Knocks down that one. Gillis with 24 tonight. A season high for Gilly. Gillis now with 25. Ventulon out for Culpepper. Culpepper, a defensive force. Gonna have to get his hands up on the floor. Cole Pepper on the floor as well. They'll get it alive. Back to Ali. Ali behind the back. Boy, can he handle the ball. Bounce pass to Bradley Jr. Bradley Jr. gets into the paint. Right hand, tough finish, and one. You don't want to foul there. That's the situation when you cannot foul. 84-76. Again, time is running out on the Lions, but doing everything they can to get back in this one. 22 seconds. Ventulon back in the game for Culpepper. Culpepper, great minutes tonight. 12 points in the first half. In the game is Murad Berrien. Berrien has no points tonight, but he has seen four minutes in the first half. He'll guard Uzdevenis. Saw so many on the baseline. Still looking, and he'll take a timeout. 84-77, 22 seconds left. Can the Jirenes close it out here inside Donahue Academy?
84-74 lead for Ave as we welcome you back inside Donahue Academy. In game two of the doubleheader, we had the women's taking a tough loss to the Lions. Jireen's looking to finish off this victory. 22 seconds. Salsamendi will inbound again. Waiting, looking. He's got Klikas. Klikas is fouled by Barian. So Klikas at the line. And assuming the Jireens can close it out, they will improve to 4-3 and three on the season. 2-0 and oh in the Sun Conference, so a nice start for Jamin Copeland in his first season back at Ave. A 2-0 and oh start in a tough conference like this one is impressive no matter who you're playing. Klikas knocks down the first. Meanwhile, for Florida Memorial, they will fall to 1-2 and two on the year and 1-2 and two in the Sun Conference. So all three of their opponents have been in the Sun Conference. Tough way to start it with all your non-conference games being canceled. It's definitely tough to find a rhythm before you get into the conference play. 86-77, 21 seconds. Barian with a ball, crosses half court, tipped out of bounds on Salsamendi. Jirene still with the defensive effort even with 17 to play. Bradley Jr. to inbound. Swings it over to... Clayton, deep three, no good. Rebound by Tristan Stevens with a dunk. 86-77, still pressuring. Gillis with the ball. Gillis, maybe an extra step. They'll call a foul, though, on Bradley Jr. That's on Bradley Jr., his third. So Matt Gillis with 25 points tonight will head to the line again. Gillis knocks down the first, 26. Well, Gillis, part of that big time group of transfers for Coach Copeland. Knocks down the second, he's got 27 tonight. And we will go ahead and name Matt Gillis our MVP of tonight's game. One more shot here from Tristan Stevens, hits a deep three. 88-82 will be your final score here at Donahue Academy. Your MVP, Matt Gillis, 27 points. Big time effort for Gillis. Salsamendi also, 19 points. And the Jireens improved to four and three overall, two and oh in the Sun Conference. Meanwhile, the Florida Memorial Lions fall to one and two overall and one and two in the Sun Conference. For myself, Billy Derrick, saying good night from Donahue Academy. You've been watching the Sun Conference Men's Basketball Game of the Week on the Sun Digital Network.